I'm delusional, you're delusional. Actually, no, you're a liar. And that, my friends, is where the problem comes in. <laughs> she was a fairy. You should not gamble ever in your life. You're bad at it. You won't regret it. Hey, y'all, what's up? Good morning. Well, not really good morning. It's currently 3.39 p.m. And as you can see, we are on our way out of the house. We look good. My hair was supposed to be flipped on the ends, but it, it's not flipping no more. And it's really irritating me, you know? But I guess whatever it is, what it is. Um, Yeah, we're going to a influencer event for Steve Madden. Not our first one. Not our first one. What my, what my hairspray? Hold on. If you follow me on Instagram, you've seen this outfit before. But this is what we're wearing. I thrifted this top, H&M uh, bottoms, shorts, whatever you want to call them. Of course, the bag, we have to bring her back out. I feel like, uh, what's her name? And then cowboy boots. It is a cowboy theme event. Um, and I decided to go the non-traditional cowgirl route. Like this is, this is really from Texas cowgirl. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's go. Come on, play my stuff. Play my stuff. I know you're gonna play it. Siri, I believe in you. Dang it. It wasn't up next. This is a good one, too. This is a good one. This is a good one. I know you missed me. Bye bye my love. Reminiscing. Bye bye my love. Reminiscing. We are history. History. Bye bye my love. You know the crazy thing is, it says it's gonna take us ten minutes to go two miles. Ten minutes. But I've been having a good drive here. I've been listening to Masego the whole way here. The album is just good. It's just good, okay? He did his, uh, Masego is probably one of my favorite artists, by the way. But this album, crazy. It, it, the whole thing rides, the whole album. I have my favorites, of course. But the whole album is good. <sighs> they just, they just, they're ah, talent, you know, talent. Anyway. Like I was saying, we're almost here. My hair has fallen. I flipped up the curls. I don't even think y'all was able to see that at the house. I have flipped up the ends of my hair and they decided they didn't want to do that. So, yeah, we just have kind of this little front curl situation going on right here. And um, at this point, just gotta let it do what it wanna do, you know? I have my shades on and I think I'm gonna wear my shades um, into the event. But obviously my camera is disrespectful and it never likes to see me fall. You know? It doesn't want to see me succeed. Because why do you always not see my face when I have on shades? Good thing though, it's like a little shady right here because we have all the tall buildings or whatever. So my eyes aren't hurting. Woo! Oh, it ain't nobody in front of him. Oh, it ain't nobody in front of him. Oh, okay. <sighs> breathe, Adrian. Breathe, 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 breathe. Wow, it was really, it was really nobody in front of him. He just a. Yeah, it's just been a really peaceful, for the most part, ride. I forgot my family's having a um, event at the park, so we're gonna go to that when we leave. I don't plan on being here that long. Maybe like 30 minutes, 30 minutes to an hour. But that's also like five o'clock traffic, so it's kind of crazy. That's kind of crazy. But the the event at the park ends at seven, and this ends at seven too. So I want to go. It's Good Friday, by the way. Happy Good Friday, y'all. Mm. At least by the time I decide. Take to the leave, exit. I 
decide to leave, it'll be closer to six o'clock. And granted, traffic don't really die down until like seven, but closer to six is better than four thirty-five. You know. So yeah. Anyway, we're almost here. I'll pick y'all back up when we're walking into the uh, mall because we have to find somewhere to park. <laughs> I'm so excited. We're going on our first ever brand event hosted by Steve Madden. One thing about me, I love me some shoes and I love me some Steve Madden. So this was right on brand. I walked into these little cute boot cookies and can bevs. These shoes were so cute and these boots were fire, by the way. It was a Western theme event. So of course the boots were the star of the show and these, oh my gosh, I fell in love and with. If you didn't know, I love me a good snip toe. They were having a buy one, get one sale and they were also doing boot engravings. I thought that was so cool, but unfortunately, I didn't get any boots today. I did try on one pair, but I was a little bit nervous because, you know, hashtag white calf problems. Anyway, I took a look around the store and I found these shoes. Ugh, y'all know I love a good heel. I tried on three pairs. Let me know in the comments down below which ones y'all think I ended up getting. This was such a cool event. I met so many beautiful creators. The event was open to the public and the associates didn't know who was who and the customer service was 10. And to my man Steve, thank you for inviting me to the crib, Buki. Hey y'all, we just left the event. Mmm. I mean, the little cookie they gave us. Dang, I ain't gonna make it on time. Dang it. You know, like we gonna make it to um my family event, but we got our shoes. I'm gonna still try to get there. It's still a little bit longer. Hold on, girl. <laughs> it took a little bit longer for me to pick out a shoe. Because at first I thought we were there for boots, you know? Yeah, they didn't have any wide calf options. So at first I was just going to leave. <laughs> because, again, we're there for boots, you know? But, Dana and... Dang it, I didn't even get her name. Dana, and I don't know if she was a manager or what, but they were like, you're not leaving without pair shoes. And y'all don't know how much, <laughs> how much that meant to me, you know? Like, I'm sitting here <laughs> with all these other girls and they're picking out their heels. I mean, they're picking out their boots, you know, and they're getting their boots engraved and stuff. And here I am. Can't put my calf in the boot. <laughs> but, but I will say that I am so grateful. I'm sorry, the AC is so hot because it was hot. Um, but I'm so grateful. I'm just so grateful to have experienced my first influencer event. That was real cool. They had ranch waters, those were good. Stay in the left five lanes. They were kind of the same ones that they have at the rooftop cinema. And so in about 10 miles. So I know I'm gonna insert the um, clip of like my experience there and everything like that. So hopefully y'all enjoyed that. And now we're on the way to my family. <laughs> Because I'm the best looking cousin of all. You're literally my brother. Hey, but she, she hated it. She hated it. Hey, girls. I left my tripod in the car. So, y'all are just kind of like chilling on my pillow. <laughs> um, my camera's about to die. It's a whole lot later. I'm so exhausted. <sighs> um. But I want to show y'all what shoes I got from Steve Madden today. They're so cute. I love them so much. <laughs> oh, yeah. Please. Uh, I cannot wait to put these on. I, y'all know I love a heel. Y'all know I love a heel. I can't wait. And it's like a square toe. 
I these are a back outside heel. Uh yeah, I'm back outside. Uh -huh. <laughs> they red digging a baby pad. Ooh. Mm. Good night. I'm spending time with y'all's favorite smaller person. Yeah. But he don't have no clothes on right now, so he can't be in the vlog. He's also making brownies. No, a brookie, right? A brookie. A brookie, a brownie cookie. I'm his supervisor, so I'm sitting in the kitchen editing the vlog for him. Well, sitting in the kitchen editing the vlog and watching him. But he did it on his own. <laughs> 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 but anyway today is saturday Ew. we didn't do anything well he did he went to a party i was at home all day so i didn't record i've been watching insecure if y'all follow <laughs> if y'all follow me on tiktok we did our episode with six and seven today i think yeah six and seven which he shouldn't be watching them stay popping my food page anyway so we did episode six and seven today. And oh, they done. Two more minutes though. You gotta try the toothpick though. Do the toothpick first. Uh, I'm gonna start swearing again, yeah, bro. I just cool I'm trying to teach him how to like bake and stuff. He already knows how to cook some things, right? I don't know how to cook steak. You don't know how to cook steak. Bake with Salisbury steak, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, yeah, so that's what we've been doing, but I've been chilling. Don't burn yourself. Sure. Can't use the insurance. Go. I told you, I told you you ain't listening. Don't put that on the, on the counter like that. Okay. You gotta put something underneath it. Do it now. You are supposed to put that up there first. You know what? That ain't my problem. Actually it is, cause we'll be supervising him. Sit it on the stove at least. No, I'm talking. Okay, what are you talking about? I'm talking about the brownie cookie. It's hot, so sit it on the stove. It's not, you can't sit it on ground, um, granite. I have it on the towel. Ooh. <laughs> oh, the camera just left me dying. Tomorrow is Easter. Yes, so I'll pick y'all up when whatever we do tomorrow. <laughs> She was a fairy. Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name's Adrienne if you're new. And if you're not new, welcome back to another motherfucking vlog. Right now, we are on the way to UPS store. It's currently 5, what is it, like 5, 5.58. <laughs> it's 5.58. Um, Y'all got ready with me this morning, like we took a shower and everything like that, but I kind of just been, not really lounging around, but I've been editing all day, so I haven't been doing too, too much of anything, so that's why I haven't picked y'all back up, but now we're on the road because we have to go and drop this dress off at the UPS store because I'm about to go on vacation. <laughs> I need to figure out if I'm going to order another dress or if I'm just going to say F it and just go with what I have in my closet, you know? But either way, I'm still going to send this dress back and I want to do it before I go. Excuse me, I want to do it before I go because if I don't, it's not going to get done. <laughs> it's not going to get done. So, that's where we're headed now. And then we might stop by Walmart because I need to um, pick up some snacks for the cruise. So, I want to get... You know, you know the cruise is when I do my, my, my thick girl duties. The cruise, I'm not worried about nothing else. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to give me some Oreos. Yeah, I'm gonna give me some 
dark chocolate Oreos. And y'all don't know. I it's it's so bad. Like I, I can't really buy I might have to get two packs, you know what I'm saying? Because it's what two two three days before the cruise. What's today? Monday? Yeah, we leave on Thursday. So it's two days before the cruise. And <laughs> I will eat my Oreos before I get on the boat. The whole pack. And you can't really bring not even can't really, you can't bring the open snacks on the boat. So I'm gonna have to get two packs. <laughs> it's so sad. I love Oreos. <laughs> love Oreos. Anyway, nonetheless, I'm gonna get some Oreos. And not just not just regular Oreos, by the way. I'm not a basic girl, okay? My favorite ones are the red ones. The the dark chocolate with the red in the middle. I mean the chocolate with the red in the middle. Them only come around in the holiday time. The holiday times so. though. Dang, I sound like <laughs> I sound like what's her name? I got all the snacks. Anyway, whatever. I'm basically saying I love Oreos and I can't be trusted around them. So, I'm trying to decide if I want to go ahead and get them now. Or if I want to wait until like the day before. Because I'm going to get some Oreos and I'm going to get some um, fudge rounds. If you know, you know. And if you don't like fudge rounds, are we really friends? Fudge rounds are like top tier. I, I, I freaking love fudge rounds. <laughs> Y'all just listening to all of my little snacks or whatever. Girl, I just like chocolate. I like chocolate. I like dark chocolate. But then again, I was thinking about getting some of my um, double dark chocolate. What are them cookies by? Who are them cookies by? I can't think of the name, but they're double dark chocolate. And they're like little wafer cookies. Ugh! Oh, they're so fine. They're so fine. But the only thing about them is if I get those, I can't take them on the boat because the boat don't really have milk like that. Or do they? I'm not really sure. I think they have milk in the mornings, but I be wanting it at night. And I don't want to dip them cookies in my ice cream because they be a little kind of hard unless you got some milk. Hmm. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, I'm thinking about the wrong thing, girl. Okay, so I want to go get my snacks but I'm trying to decide and you know what you know what I'll say that dang cuz I should have I should have been got out the house but then again I was editing dang it I should have been got out the house because I still got to go to the bank I gotta pick up these snacks I don't have my clothes packed this is pretty much gonna be like a get my life together or get ready for vacation vlog I'm not getting my lashes done I told y'all I'm taking a lash break so this is gonna be what it is y'all just gonna get my bare face I need to go get some more um, lip gloss or lip oil I didn't tell y'all I've been trying out the <gasps> did I bring it with me no I've been trying out the elf lip oil so good I really like it the only problem is it don't last that long and I, and I say it don't last that long because I got it back in, I got it at the beginning of March. Yeah, it was like, it was like the, towards the end of uh, February, beginning of March where I got it and it's almost gone. Like almost gone. And y'all know like with Laneige, my Laneige I got back in December. And it just, I just ran out of it at the end of February. So, to me, <laughs> to me, in my opinion, that's not a long time. But I'm also considering going to Sephora and getting the topicals one because I've been trying to get my hands on that one. I'm going through an experiment. Oh, if y'all stop at this light. Oh. Oh. Uh-huh, see the lady behind me, man, too. Girl, I ain't even had no control over it, boo. It was her in front of me. She stopped. She 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 stopped. Anyway, I've been uh, testing out different, like, lip products. Because sometimes I find myself 
bias. I found myself biased and I need to get out of my comfort zone and try new things. And so that's why I've been trying out different lip products. Let me see if uh, Sephora has this in stock. Because last time they sent me a hey boo message and I ain't like that. I ain't like that. I'm glad I didn't stop. Okay. I mean, it's still out of stock. Okay, no. It's not out of stock across town. But I'm not driving all the way over there. That ain't happening. Ugh. Well, at least not today. <laughs> at least not today. I might I'm, I might drive for it. I ain't gonna lie. If I'm in the area, I'll probably stop by and get some of that. Um, As y'all can see, my hair is currently like flipped up it's so cute i used to do this all the time when i was like first transitioning and my hair was in this length and it was so cute let me see it is cute i use my hopefully y'all can see me better i use my um flat iron on 250 this time which is like half of what i typically use um and so when I was doing it like this, that's when my hair was in the best condition because I wasn't using a lot of heat, you know. 250 is not a lot of heat at all. <sighs> and so, I um, might be going back, trying to go back. Okay, somebody sent me a picture. Somebody, <laughs> we had took a picture, you know, a long time ago. I would say maybe 20, 2015, right? It had to be 2015 because I think we had just graduated. And we took a picture and my little fro was so cute but i used to flat iron my hair a lot and so i was like how was my fro so healthy but i used to flat iron my hair so much oh nothing but cakes mm. that sound real good right now oh kroger is right here huh is kroger more expensive for oreos because <laughs> i know target be taxing Come on, Pookie. But yeah, um, they sent me a picture. And I was like, dang, my hair was so cute. You know, the little coils. Like, I have not been taking care of my curls at all, baby. I, I have not been caring for my curls at all. Not one bit. But back then, they used to look so good. And I used to have like a little fro. A little curly fro. And it was so fire. But, you know, that's gone. Gone are the days. Gone are the days. That's what I'm trying to say. Hold on, y'all. I'll be back. I got to go drop this package off now. If y'all need the air, turn it on. But I'm going to leave it off. <laughs> okay, I do have a list of things I need to remember to pack. I need to go get some hand soap for the room. And then a little spray bottle. And some sunscreen. But I think my mama got some sunscreen. <laughs> my mama got some sunscreen. And then I want to get something to drink. I need to call Hannah. I want to get something to drink. Because we can take one case of soda on the boat per person. Uh, don't want to go that way. Which way is Walmart? Dang. Should I just go to Kroger? Kroger right here. We're going to go to Walmart. Because I got to go to Walmart anyway. I might as well run all my errands while I'm outside because I, I might not leave the house tomorrow. <laughs> Y'all know me. Y'all know how I do. Excuse me, ma'am. Thank you, boo. But y'all know how I be. I'll be like, yeah, we're going we gonna to do this tomorrow. We're going to do that tomorrow. Tomorrow come and I'll be like, mm. <laughs> I'm probably leaving the house. I don't feel like leaving the house. Plus, I have a lot of editing to do. I uploaded all of the footage from the uh, the cruise vlog that I'm trying to have out on Thursday. It's like, I'm trying to have it edited and uploaded to YouTube so that on Thursday, while we're getting on the boat, I can just whoop, press press um, public, make it public. And then I also have to edit the vlog for Sunday. So, yeah. I just need to have it like all edited so that on Monday I can go ahead and you know upload it. Tight, tight, tight. 
<laughs> Ty. <laughs> That's so funny. My little brother has me saying that. It's hilarious. Ty snacks again and then i'm also like dang nah i for sure i'm gonna tear them down i that don't make no sense it doesn't make any sense of how bad my sweet tooth is like it's ridiculous honestly <laughs> it's ridiculous there's no way that i ate a whole almost a whole box of fruit snacks by myself fruit snacks and you know what? I blame my mother. I blame my mother because when we were kids, she wouldn't let us have <laughs> she wouldn't let us have no fruit snacks. She wanted to ration them. She wanted to give us one fruit snack a day type of thing. You know what I'm saying? And 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 me being an adult now with money, I, I bought the fruit snacks. You know what I'm saying? I bought the box. That was only two dollars. <laughs> that was only two dollars. And back then it was cheaper. You know, back then, that was much cheaper. That was probably like 50 cents. A dollar 50. Now they two dollars. And I and I got that. I got that. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna buy the fruit snacks and I'm gonna eat the box. <laughs> I'm gonna buy the fruit snacks and I'm gonna eat the box. And that, my friends, is where the problem comes in. Because I, in fact, do not need to eat the whole box of fruit snacks, you know? But I did. I had them dang on, what do they call Arizona teas. If you ever in the store. Matter of fact, if I see them in here, I might cop them. I might go ahead and get them. But they're like Arizona tea fruit snacks. Ooh, now my hand's ashy like this. And I've been all up in the camera. But they're Arizona tea fruit snacks. But they're the half and half kind. Like half tea, half mango. Half strawberry have lemonade i believe i believe it's only only like three flavors three or four damn fruit snacks so good <laughs> i gave my little brother two out of the box within the next 24 hours they were gone gone like the wind maybe i should be satisfied and I'm getting Oreos because I know we're gonna have ice cream, you know what I'm saying? And Oreos and ice cream is always a lot. Are you coming with me? You following me? That's my problem. I'll be feeling <laughs> I'll be feeling like everybody want me. But if you was just flirting with me in traffic and now you behind me at the light. Hmm. The Libra has been Libraing so bad. Front spot, front spot. Okay. We're going in here. We're getting Oreos. We're getting little Debbie cakes. And we're out. We're out. Eat. Eat we're back home from Walmart. Dang, I didn't even I didn't even get the bag to show y'all what I got. I showed y'all in the store though. I got those Oreo cakester. Not Oreo cakesters. What do they call? They're like little Oreo brownies. And then I got some um, Oreos. <laughs> it's so bad. I love Oreos. Oh my gosh. Okay, but anyway. My little brother has been in here yapping this whole time. Here he comes. Mom just ratted you out so fast. How did mom rat me out? You're leaving on a Thursday or a Saturday of this week. <laughs> mm. So which one is it? I get two guesses, okay? Because it's those two days. It's only two. It's only two guesses that you could possibly have. Yeah, you gonna say yes or no? No, so you only get one guess. Okay, you're gonna say yes or no if I'm right, okay? Yes. Oh, you already said it's so Thursday. No, I, I said. Ah, <laughs> I said Thursday. I said Thursday. I said Thursday. You already had one guess. I said Thursday. You already had one guess. I said Thursday. And then you switched it. No, I didn't. You did. What? It's on camera. You're delusional, bro. I'm delusional. You're delusional. Actually, no. You're a liar. It's on camera. We can replay the footage right now. Do you want to do that? We can replay it right now. Okay. Because I said Thursday. And then you said, no, Saturday. No, I, said Thursday. <laughs> I said Thursday. We can Which roll is too back good. the footage, bro. Hold on. Oh, you already said it's so Thursday. No, I, Saturday. I said, 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 I said,
<laughs> Nigga, we done got them caught you, my boy. <laughs> no Saturday. No Saturday. No Saturday. I'm gonna find out that. I said you're, you're terrible at bargaining. You've always been. You should not gamble ever in your life. You're bad at it. What is gambling? What you're doing right now, and you're bad at it. You would owe me multiples, multitudes of money. What multitudes? Multiple lump sums of money. Because you're always so bad at it. Stay away from gambling. You're gonna be here. I'm gonna be where I'm at. You're not gonna be in that boat? How you gonna tell me? How are you gonna tell me twice? That's what y'all like. Traffic. Thursday morning. Okay. Traffic. Okay. I'm not arguing with you no more. So, I'm gonna call you. And I'm not gonna answer. And. Well, Cause I'm gonna where? On the boat. On that boat. Are you done bothering me? Like, are you just, you just here to hear yourself talk? Is that what this is? Cause, cause I have things to do. I have a vlog to talk to. I have editing to do. I have a show to watch. Oh! No, 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 no. Alone. You said we. You no, said no, no. I, I said we. I. I heard we. That's because you have something wrong with you. I said I. You said we. No, no, no. Because cause I have things to do. I have a vlog to talk to. I have editing to do. I have a show to watch. I caught you in 4K. <laughs> I caught you in 4K. I I have a vlog to talk to. I have editing to do. I have a show to watch. Where are you getting weed from? No clue. Again, terrible at lying. The show. You should probably not lie when there are like clear evidence. You only have like 90,000 subscribers. And how many do you have? Ah! I'm about to throw something at your head. 91.6. And it's gonna land. I'm great at dodging stuff. Why does he choose to irritate me? No clue. No clue. Um, here is the D not I said Dior, girl, this ain't no damn Dior. Here is the elf lip gloss that I was telling y'all about. Lip oil. This is how much I have left. Can y'all see that? Ketchup mustards. You see that? It is literally this is it. It's all on one side. I have been using this stuff like crazy. It's really good. Like, I really like it. I just wasn't expecting that. We might run this back if my other freaking lip gloss is not in stock. I'm just trying. I just want to find, you know, like, I'm trying to get out my comfort zone. But the comfort zone is keeping me comforted. Okay. Anyway, we're back home. I ended up getting the uh, brownies that I showed y'all and then Oreos. So now, I'm editing the vlog. I'm about to turn it back on Insecure because I have been watching that like crazy. Um, because it's just so good. Like, it's just so good. But like I was saying, today was a pretty boring day for the vlog. I'm sorry it wasn't, you know, more interesting and I didn't engage with y'all a little bit more. But tomorrow we have... A lot to do. I kind of want to prepare myself for tomorrow. Do I, okay. Wait. What do I have to do tomorrow? Cause I haven't gone to the bank yet. Um. <laughs> My mind is everywhere. My mind is just jumping everywhere. So I know I need to go take some money out the bank, and then I need to wash clothes. I need to figure out what I'm wearing on this boat because I have no clue. I'm probably gonna repeat some outfits from the last cruise. Um, and then what else I need to do? I need to edit the vlog again, which I'm gonna edit as much as I can. Y'all, it's like eight hours of footage. <laughs> footage from this vlog. So I'm gonna edit as much as I can tonight and then try to finish it up tomorrow. And then um, what else? I still need to record. Do I need to record? Well, I don't really have to record anything to be posted because I have enough content um, to be posted while I'm gone for Instagram and TikTok and shorts. So I think we should be good. I just want to make sure that everything is like in order before I leave. And then I need to clean this room up because it is getting 
crazy. I did a little spot cleaning this morning, but I didn't do like a deep dive that I need to. So we're gonna do that. Probably not tomorrow. We'll probably do. We'll probably do. Probably do that on Wednesday. And we also need to go to the gym because I didn't go to the gym. <gasps> That's what I want to show y'all. I got these soft baked cookies. Ugh. I forgot I didn't eat today. <laughs> I forgot I didn't eat today. And I got these cookies, right? And and I'm only telling y'all this because I'm trying to be transparent. These lemon cookies, my mama, and that's the problem. I always get stuff my mama wouldn't let us eat that she would buy when we was younger. And and when I get them now, I can't control myself, you know, because. <laughs> so I got these lemon cookies that she used to always get. Let me show you. They're from Pepperidge Farm, I believe. I don't feel like going to get the bag, uh, but they're Pepperidge Farm cookies. They're soft baked lemon cookies. When I tell y'all it's eight cookies in the bag, first of all, why would y'all only put eight cookies in a bag? That's kind of nuts. It's eight cookies in the bag. Y'all, I ate half the cookies. Half the bag is gone. And I just, <laughs> I was on the phone and I'm eating the cookies and I'm driving and I'm like, something like once I got off the phone, something just clicked and was like, how many cookies have you ate? Cause they were just so good. And I, I was gonna keep going. I was about to keep going, but something in my head was like, girl, look at how many cookies you ate. Before you know it, I had already ate four and I was biting into the fifth one. Like, so when you go to the gym, <laughs> we gotta go to the gym. Um, I also wanna pack some gym clothes because I do wanna go to the gym this time on the boat. Because last time I was just kind of, you know, roaming around. But I really did want to go to the gym last time. So, enough with that. I'm about to go ahead and get into what I was telling y'all I'm about to get into. We'll probably just talk again in the morning. And, uh, oh, we also got to do my hair. Yeah, so we got to do all that so that I can do my hair on Wednesday. Because I want to do a, um, what's it called? A half up, half down with the glue. What is it called with the glue? What is it called with the glue? Quick weave. Do I know what I'm doing? Not all the way. Are we gonna figure it out? Absolutely. Today is, what's today? Today is, dang, do I have any lashes to take? It's 11.25 a.m. Today's Wednesday. I leave tomorrow. What is my hair doing? I have no clue what my hair is doing. I have no clue what I'm doing with my hair, actually. Let's talk about it. I have a meeting at um, two o'clock, so I have to be home by two. I just left out of Sephora because I wanted to see if they probably, possibly had the topicals because I just refuse to go on vacation without no uh, chapstick, like without no lip gloss, you know what I'm saying? And I've been trying, I told y'all, I've been trying like different types of lip, lip glosses and stuff. And so the last one that I tried was, um, the elf lip oil which i really like i really like but before i commit okay oh, okay before i commit to one brand you know because because for so long i was so committed <laughs> so committed to laneige you know which i still love a good laneige don't don't get me wrong still love a good laneige but i don't know because i tried the lip oil by elf girl i did one side of my edges because my hair is supposed to be like this but it's, it's just doing a lot it's doing a lot right now um but yeah i tried the elf and i was like oh this is kind of nice the only thing is that i went through the elf one so quickly so quickly but granted i mean i guess i went through the top i mean not topicals the um laneige one quickly too depending on how you view it <laughs> Depending on how you view it, because I went through two tubes in three months. But I went through this one tube of <laughs> Well that I guess that would make sense then. Dang. See I'll be talking myself into doing stuff, you know. But either way. Point is I want to go and find that topicals one because I want to try it. Like I, I found that I am enjoying a stickier 
not necessarily sticky but like longer lasting type of gloss type of you know lip treatment lip oil thing um the the elf one is very slick it lasts a little bit longer why is my ear itching that's weird um yeah the elf one is a little bit stickier it lasts a little bit longer than the Laneige and the Laneige is really soft and it makes your lips like really buttery they all do different things you know and so I'm just trying to figure out which one do I like the most you know granted eventually I will probably just have different ones for different events you know but until then I'm trying them out yeah I am so sad so so sad I did not plan out this whole lash break thing very well. I didn't think it all the way through. Because my lashes are still kind of sparse in the middle, you know? And the last time I took my lashes out by myself, it's, it's my fault, it's my fault. <laughs> it's my fault that I don't have no lashes. And so now I have to go on vacation without lashes. Now granted, I have enough lashes to get like a classic set a hybrid set but i don't want that I, I want my full volume stacked up back it up and dump it set you know what i'm saying and if i can't have that i would just rather not that's just me personally but um today is a really beautiful day outside it feels so good i have on like this long sleeve crop top and it's perfect for the weather right now. I believe it's, what's the weather outside of the series? 65 degrees outside. 65 and sunny. It's 65 and sunny and I feel good. I woke up this morning, I took a shower, said my prayers, I thank the Lord. Whew. Listen to some music, clean my room up. I just, it just feels like a really good day. And I feel like this is a great start to the vacation excuse me i have to get the little you know you know you feeling like it's <laughs> something in the corner of your mouth mm -hmm. so i had to fix that anyway but it just feels like a great start to a great week you know my little brother is completely having convulsions right now because he doesn't know where i am i told him <laughs> i told him that i was leaving today and so he had been texting me and I'm not replying. <laughs> I'm not replying. I'll see you when you get home. Okay. Even though it's my fault. It's my fault. Okay. I just like messing with him. But my little brother is so sad that I'm going without him. And I'm like, sir, I, I don't know where he got this idea from, but he really believes that he is my responsibility. He really believes that he's my child, you know, financially at least. <laughs> financially and I just don't understand I, I have I'm just not comprehending I'm having a hard time understanding and you know what actually I know why because when I was younger when he was first born that, that oh it's my fault it's my fault it's my fault because I used to take him I used to have to like pick him up from daycare after I left high, like uh, after I left school in high school if he would have a good day at daycare or if he would have a good day at school, I would take him to like the dollar store or like I would take him to Family Dollar to get a snack, like a treat. <laughs> and so eventually, because I was working, like I, I started working when I was 16. So, I, and I wasn't making that much money. Now keep this in mind, I wasn't making that much money. So yeah, I was like buying them, you know, clothes, when I could or like I'll buy them food when I could <laughs> so every Friday I would take him so he had a limit after school it was five dollars almost every day it was five dollars okay but on Fridays if he had a good week in school and he had been doing good he didn't have no uh, bad things on his conduct I would let him get whatever he wanted you know he didn't have no limit <laughs> and so now I think the little Negro thinks that I am supposed to like take care of him even even though I have been you know what I'm saying PlayStation cards shoes food money I, I just I just want to know actually I know because I asked him one time I'm, I'm gonna insert that clip in the vlog I said how does it feel 
to have older siblings with money because I don't know what that feels like. I don't I don't know what that feels like. My older sibling didn't get money until we was grown. We're headed to the bank because I have to get some money for the trip, of course. Um, I do want to stop and get coffee. And I think it's the Dutch Brothers over here. Is there a Dutch Brothers? I don't know. I don't know. I just want some good coffee or like a matcha. One or the other. But some you can't trust everybody matcha now. Everybody matcha don't be tasting the same. They don't be tasting good. Some people matcha be uh, watery. And then other people matcha be too strong. Okay. So you just can't trust everybody matcha. So I wonder, hmm, where is some good matcha? Or like, what other kind of coffee would I want if I didn't want matcha? I also haven't eaten anything. I haven't ate to, uh, this morning. I really just want some fruit. So first of all, hold up. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it because this is something that y'all have been uh, commenting under my last post when I was complaining about, you know, not seeing the scale move at all and for the most part everybody's advice was absolutely correct absolutely correct but it was one comment in particular that stood out and they were basically like you need to eat like you you're not supposed to be not eating you're supposed to eat more if you're you know and that's the problem that's my problem right there I, in my head I'm like yeah I'm gonna eat more get my protein in I just want fruit <laughs> I just want fruit I just want fruit and vegetables good vegetables but vegetables you know you can't always find the good fruit though like the good fruit season just started I don't know why my camera looks like that. Like it looks blue. I have no clue why it's doing that. Probably because the sun is like right here. But yeah. I'm, I'm just saying. Like I, I'm trying to eat. You know. But if it's not bread. What is over there? There's something touching something. And it's bothering me. But I don't see anything. But if it's not something that's like bread. Which is another oh it's just a terrible weak spot of mine oh i just it's something about sugar and bread sugar bread and fruit is all i be wanting to eat sometimes you know We just left the post office. Chanel, girl, your wig is on the way. Period, period, period. I had to get that sent out before. I know that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I just watched somebody. It's so fun, like, seeing other people get their content in because I would really be feeling alone in the world, you know, even though I know I'm not. But I know that's right. He just took a picture before he went into the post office. Anyway, Chanel, girl. Yo wig is on the way. I had to get that out before I left. So, thank you so much for supporting the wig sale, girl. I think it's like two wigs left, two or three wigs left. So, there's that. I got my checklist going. It's only 12 o'clock right now. So, we're doing really good on timing. I'm trying to decide, do I feel like driving? Let me see how far it is because I might actually make that drive. Look at this. I'm not going on the boat with just this. And I really, really want the topicals one. And since I'm already driving, like, you know what I'm saying? I might as well. I was looking for some coffee, like some coffee shops and stuff to stop by at right now, like over here, but it ain't nothing. And I just don't understand. Okay, when I get home, I gotta pack. I have to get a bottle, but I'm gonna do that before I leave, okay. So the only thing I have to do is pick up a bottle and get um, some lip gloss of some sort. So let me see if Sephora, and I don't mind driving today. I also wanted to get that damn Patrick Ta, the Major, blow, uh, major Glow Ball. <laughs> 
why would I say blow gum? Blow gum. Girl, what? Should I have just tried the to uh, Tower 28 one? I haven't heard much about that one. We're heading to Sephora now. And we're gonna stop and get us some coffee and something to snack on on the way. Hopefully, hey, should I stop by like the store and get some fruit? I really, really, really want some fruit right now. So turn that, left onto. I've been listening to my absolute favorite album again. I took it. <laughs> I took a break from it because I felt like I was playing uh, playing it too much. But now we back on it. We back on our bullshit. Cause I, this is one album I, I don't think I can get tired of, and I just haven't gotten tired of yet. And I don't want to, you know. <laughs> I don't want to. But this morning, I woke up. Just turn. Thank you. This morning I woke up and was like, you know what? What is that? I missed my favorite album. And so I started playing it again. That's what we're gonna listen to. Go ahead and play. Give me our track and keys. It's safe forever. Baby, let's go. data is being so slow right now and it's really about to make me mad <laughs> yeah about to make me mad okay these are all like actual coffee shops I'm not trying to stop in a coffee shop just coffee <laughs> okay yeah these are all coffee you know what let's find some boba because I really can really tear down some boba real quick I think we're gonna get bubble. Is there a bubble spot by home? Yes, but we're definitely gonna need that before we get home. All right, we're gonna go get some boba because I am feeling boba right now. I told y'all I wanted some like like coffee or matcha, and I think I'm really settled on matcha. In three quarters of but yeah, I think I'm leaning more towards matcha versus coffee, and I. <laughs> I can always eat boba, you know? So we're gonna go and get some boba. 45 South toward Galveston. On the left is crazy. Okay, we might as well go home. We, we might as well go home because I missed that exit. I, I, I missed that one. They not letting me over. Okay. Well. <laughs> well, I guess we have other plans going for us. Take me home. All right, y'all. We are about to go ahead and run the rest of our errands. All I need to do is get a bottle and I need to get... What else I need to do? I forgot. But we got our topicals lip gloss. I'm not going to open it just yet. I'm going to wait till we get home to open it. But yeah. I'll see y'all in just a second. The camera finna die. But girl, get you a matcha double boba, if you like boba, with strawberry syrup. You won't regret it! <laughs> mm. We back home. <laughs> Let's get into what all I picked up. Ooh, I already finished my boba. <laughs> I'm kinda sad about that, actually. That was so good. I don't even know if I got to show y'all that but <sighs> anyway we move so went to the bank cleaned my room dropped the wigs off um bought a bottle went there went there i gotta print my luggage tags pack do my hair and fix my nails which i'm really not doing anything to my nails nails i just need to fix my toenails because you know gel polish or whatever so I need to do that. I already got the cups. So these are gonna be, hopefully, ooh, hopefully that wasn't too loud. These are gonna be the cups that I'm taking. I'm taking this one, of course, of course. And then I'm taking, oh, 
my mama's cup. <laughs> I'm gonna take my mama cup because it's a smaller one. So, okay. So we got that. So now all we have to do is figure out what to do with my hair, do my nails, pack, and print my luggage tags, which I'm pretty much packed. Everything is, let me show y'all. Everything is like on the bed. It's just thrown here. Back of my suitcases right there. With that being said, let's go ahead and get into what I picked up and I'm so, so excited. I'm so excited. So first for the liquor, I went to Total Wine. And I went there for Terramana originally because we are a Terramana family. Ever since my daddy introduced me to Terramana, that's all I drink. I don't like Patron. I don't like Don Julio. Ugh. Please. Okay. So Terramana is my drink. But the lady in Total Wine was like, girl, you're missing out. Like, <laughs> she was like, Terramana is good, but it's not the best. And I was like, what? What? And then she had me tasting different types of wines. Now, I, I said wines. Tequilas. Because I am getting tequila. So, she was like, she had me try this pantalones. So good. Anejo. All the way. I'm an Anejo girl. So good. But then she brought this out. Because I need a Blanco. Because I'm going to have to color it. We're going to have to, you know, we're going to have to make some stuff work. So, she brought this out. It's a Blanco. Girl. She brought this out in the bottle at first. I was like, oh, no, don't worry about it, because it looks like a bottle of Patron Don Julio type of thing. You know, anything that comes in a little square bottle, I'm like, mm, uh, uh, you know, but she said, just try it. <laughs> and the way she got me is she said, don't knock it till you try it. And that's something that I stand by. Like, I'm always a don't knock it till you try it type of girl. And she said those words to me. I said, you got a challenger. I am the challenger and so I tried it and as you can see I'm holding it it's at home with me when I tell you I didn't taste nothing I didn't taste nothing it didn't burn it didn't hit me here I didn't taste nothing I said oh Immediately, yes. Immediately, yes. So, we're going to take this with us. So excited about this. And then, um, what else? My mom got me these. <laughs> some gloves and some scrub, scrubble bubbles. What do they call it? Scrubbing bubbles. And uh, she got me some other stuff to clean the, uh, clean the room with. Because, you know, we are going to clean the room before we just start to habitate. Cohabitate. <laughs> and then I drove all the way out to another Sephora because I needed this which is the Slick Mouth by Topicals I'm so excited about this I'm so excited for it excuse me I have been freaking looking for this waiting on oh it's a, it's a much smaller tube than I was anticipating I thought it was going to be bigger but let's try it <laughs> I didn't even put it out yet. It's crazy. Okay. Mmm. Oh, I love the minty. It's it's sweet. Mmm. Mmm. No, yeah. Oh, this is good. It's not that sticky. Everybody making it seem like it's it's Elmer's glue. It's not. This is good. Mmm. I got this one because they said it has sunscreen in it, right? I don't know. It had something that's supposed to like protect your lips. Mmm. I like that. Okay, period. No, that that's yeah. Yeah, that's one of the ones. Yeah. If y'all like, y'all know I always get lip gloss and stuff all over my face. But if y'all like, like it's not sticky. It just feels, it's not thick. I can't even explain it. Like it's like a, I don't, I don't even know how 
I would explain it. It's, it's good. The minty in it is good. Like it's, I feel my lips kind of tingling and I like that. You know what I'm saying? It's thick enough to stay on your lips. I can feel that. But it's not, it's not so thick that it's, like, I don't know what's wrong with their mouth. Why their mouth was doing that? Mine don't do that. Maybe I just didn't overdo it. But who knows? This is good, though. I like this. Okay. And then I think that's it. That's all pretty much for what I picked up. Now we have to pack because we have to figure out what to do with my hair. And I'm thinking I'm just going to, because I don't have a blow dryer. <laughs> I forgot that I messed up my blow dryer. So I'm thinking we're just going to rock out to the cruise port like this. You know, well, not like this. I'm probably going to, you know, do something different to it. I don't know yet. I might wash it and then redo it. But I'm thinking we're just going to rock a pin curl moment. You know what I'm saying? For a second. Um, That's kind of cute, right? Yeah, I might wash it and then reflood iron it and pin curl it so that you know I can keep this kind of volume I'm looking at my viewfinder by the way so if you are wondering what I'm looking at I'm looking at the little screen um but yeah I'm thinking I'm gonna just wear my natural hair like because y'all know I just I, it's not in me it's, it's not in me to wear no braids no more unless they straight backs I do want to get some um straight back braids but didn't book an appointment and i just honestly didn't feel like <laughs> i didn't feel like it I, mm -mm, I didn't feel like it okay so five six where seven seven is do hair i think we're gonna make that 10. so all we have to do is everything that i told y'all about earlier i decided i'm going to vlog um it's just gonna be like part of a weekly vlog type of thing i just don't want to stop vlogging right now because i'm finally getting my groove back and i want to post this vlog tomorrow for y'all's like weekly vlog i guess one of the weekly vlogs so i'm posting this vlog this vlog tomorrow and then on sunday y'all will get hopefully hopefully y'all will get the cruise vlog oh no y'all won't get that on sunday because i'll be on the boat so yeah i'm about to go ahead and start to get my stuff together and then i'll be back later or am i gonna show y'all me packing we are officially done i redid my nail because my freaking nail came off while i was um doing my toes there we go so i did Redid my uh, one nail, which was pretty easy, actually. This one feels more secure. Yeah. At first, it wasn't feeling like this. Um, but now, this one is feeling a little a little wonky, but it doesn't want to come off so that I can, like, re-glue it. So, I'm just have to wait until... <sighs> until I, um... I can get it back. You know what I'm saying? Get it back together. So, we're about to go ahead and just start my hair. I washed my edges because obviously obviously the edges are you know a little product developed what am, I, what am i trying to say they got product on them the edges do but the rest of my hair i've been intentionally leaving alone so that i don't get um like too much product on it so i'm not gonna wash my hair because tbh i don't want to if we're just being FFR, I don't want to. And I just washed my hair maybe like three days ago, four days ago. One of them. So we're about to work on my hair. <laughs> I finally decided what I'm going to do. Oh, if I can find some clips. Uh, I finally decided what I wanted to do with my hair. I'm just gonna do a mixture of both. So at first I was gonna do a half up, half down um, pony, but like with a quick leave or whatever. And now I've decided that I'm gonna do, I don't know if y'all were here. Well, some of y'all were, not everybody though. Last year 
I did this little style where you like slick back the top part, slick down the sides, and then put in a pony, right? Like a, a low pony. So I decided to do that, but instead of doing a braid or like a, some braiding here, I'm gonna do a quick weave, you know? Not a quick weave, but like actual bundles, should I say. The hardest part though, is getting my hair accurately combed. You know what I'm saying? That's the hardest part. Surprisingly, I actually don't feel stressed at all. <laughs> at all I have so much time right now and I, I kind of feel good about it the only thing is that I need to work on the blog for tomorrow and at first it was gonna be it was gonna be the um old cruise log that I told y'all I have been sitting on basically but now it's just gonna be uh is it straight now it's just gonna be this content so y'all get in this vlog tomorrow which shouldn't take me long <laughs> let me go ahead and uh finish blow drying my hair and then i'll come back to y'all whenever whenever i'm done child i'll probably come back whenever i'm done doing my hair or i'll let y'all watch me i don't know what i'm gonna do right now but y'all will know hey y'all <laughs> <laughs> oh as y'all can see the hair is done it is currently 8 59 i'm hollering because why was i just finna I was just finna, this is crazy, this is crazy, anyway, I finished my hair, and I finished watching Insecure again, <laughs> and I just, I just want Issa to know how grateful I am that she put her whole broken pazuki in this show. You know, it's just so good. It's so good. Anyway, I finished my hair. Um, Y'all want to see. So we just did a little pony. You know, it's my first time doing it. And then I have like a little braid going down in the back. I have no clue what the back looks like. And honestly, that's not my business. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's not my business. But for the most part, it's cute. Like, it, it's giving vacation, I think, I believe. So, yeah. I just had to come and tell y'all how amazing of a creator you have to be. So, the, 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 the development of the characters, the, uh, the timelines, I, the ending. Speechless, speechless. But yeah, I'm gonna go put some water on this so that it can like curl up and I'm gonna braid it. So it could be like a little braid out for in the morning. We're about to go pack. Mm, I feel like this is, this is a look, you know, especially for me to have thrown it together. You know what I'm saying? Like out of, how long has it been? Maybe two hours. It's 9 o'clock now. I started around 6.30ish. What can we say? You know, at this point. I really feel like I'm hurt that I don't have any lashes. Because this would eat. This would eat. Like, with some just lat. Like, just some... Ooh. Ooh. We should tint my brows. Don't want to do that tonight. Mine is swell. Mine is swell. Because I still have to, um. <sighs> I'm just. Yes, I just used my edge brush, child. It is what it is. Okay. 
I don't know if y'all seen this already because I did not. Oh, girl, why do I be acting like I can see from far distances? Up. Oh. <laughs> um, the hair isn't exactly the same color as my hair, but you can't really tell. So I'm gonna try not to harp over that. But I am just happy that it came out nicely, you know? So happy. Um, so yeah. I didn't plan this out. I really didn't. <laughs> I really didn't. Because now I'm making a mess. At first I was really, not dreading, but just wasn't necessarily excited for this trip. Well, I'm not saying I wasn't excited because I was excited. I've been excited. But the excitement is growing now. Like I'm starting to feel like, you know, the, the day before school or <laughs> the day before the first day of school or like, Christmas Eve type of excitement. That's that's what I'm feeling right now. And I just, ooh, I'm just so excited to see Hannah and to be on the boat with the world. I think it's so funny that when people get to know me and they hear like words that I say on a daily basis and they start to say them. Like when a boy says the world, it's so funny to me. Let's pray on the brows. The brows are on. I have a question because now it's on my mind. The girls asked me on TikTok, they were like, who do I feel like was a better fit for Issa? Y'all already know, I'm team Daniel. I thought Daniel was the one, okay? But I'm also not mad at Lawrence. <laughs> I'm also not mad at it. But for Molly, after everybody that she had been, th been through, not been through, but been with, I truly feel like Torian was her perfect match. Like, that was perfect for her. You know, I need to set a timer before I'm just talking. But yeah, I feel like Torian was her perfect match. Like, yeah. Okay, they don't look bad. They just look large. Mm. I have no clue how I feel about that. Let me go get some Q-tips so I can clean up around these brows and then we're going to start packing. time is now 2 36 i am just now sitting down <laughs> to eat dinner i just took a shower finished packing my bags all the things we completed all of our tasks for today and now i'm about to sit here and edit this vlog hopefully hopefully i can get this out to you guys today and if i do hey girl hey if y'all are watching this on thursday thank you so much for watching thank you so much for rocking with me kicking with me skating with me Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see y'all in my next one.